does washing makeup off really protect you from premature aging? One woman decided to find out by wearing makeup to bed for a month. She wanted to see how it would affect her skin. She had high-tech cameras analyze her skin. The results were pretty shocking. So look at her skin now. This is before the experiment. She, for one month, left her makeup on every single night. Her skin biologically looked a decade older after this experiment. Whoa. Those lines are deeper. The skin mm -hmm. quality is clearly diminished. Blotchy. Yeah, she, and she's all inflamed, too. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, pure, it's a pure hygiene issue, but how does that happen? What is it about the makeup, other than clogging your pores, that would cause that? I think the problem here is that not only was she not washing her face every night, she was applying more makeup the next Probably morning. Day. So after a month of just taking on makeup 30 days in a row, whose face wouldn't look like this? I know. Yeah. And we, we did want to find out more about how makeup can do this kind of damage, especially in one month. So we checked in with dermatologist Dr. Annie Chu for the 411. Washing your makeup off every night is very important. Skipping even a single night can cause your skin to age prematurely for various reasons. First, environmental pollutants can stick to the makeup, causing oxidative stress on the skin. In other words, pollutants can damage cellular structures in your skin and may even cause a decrease in the production of collagen, which is a substance that keeps our skin looking youthful and plump. Makeup also forms a barrier over the skin, which ends up locking in irritants and locking out moisturizers. This exacerbates redness and irritation, increases pore size, deepens wrinkles, all those things that make our skin appear older. So before bed, always wash with a gentle cleanser and don't forget your moisturizer. Your skin will thank you for it. And Jen, you don't need to spend $100 on your cleanser. No, it's very simple, but you know, taking care of your skin and skin hygiene is important. You can get some of these just general wipes, a scrub, and this is a cleanser, so instead of using you know, irritating or drying soaps, you can use a cleanser. And just take care of your skin, wear the moisturizer, wear sunscreen is really important. I have to say, just for, I mean, on the non-cost-effective -cost side, but from the standpoint of prevention of wrinkles, is studies have shown that Botox early on before you develop the crow's feet and those wrinkles that Travis has on top of his forehead. I don't have any wrinkles, what do you mean? Before those come, you know, Botox and Botox maintenance can prevent for you ladies out there that don't want the crow's feet. Or want, it's a more, less cost effective. Now is that why you don't have any crow's feet? I, I have none, I do it. Sorry. So basically what you're saying is my skin is ruined for life because I didn't do Botox prematurely. <laughs> you wash your face and you're a good and, boy. And, and I put makeup on now. <laughs> you're just, it's what over. Is, what, it's so over, the take man. Home is. <laughs> and I, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and say this. I think makeup-free days are important. And, and I think it's not Give only good for your skin. Break. But hey, yeah. as, a, as a man, I can say that I love days when women go makeup-free because yeah. natural beauty yeah. is, See, is the most beautiful See, that's good to hear. He yeah. likes yeah. us yeah. unnatural. I love that.